Hey guys, I have Jean here, and she came all the way from North Carolina with hopes of getting her restless legs improved, and I'm really excited today to share some information, but let's start out with Jean just explain how she's doing. She's only two days out from having surgery, so... 99% better. Way I'm better. so excited. Can't wait to get the other leg done. Great. It's yeah. like a miracle. She, she kind of really researched this too, so she really did her due diligence mm -hmm. to see if this is a real thing, and I'm so happy to see that she's doing well. Uh, but the thing I want to talk to you about today is A, she's doing better. We did her left leg and then a week we're going to do her right leg. But I'm going to zero in on this area here. It's called the superficial perineal nerve. And this is one of the main nerves that we think is implicated because it's got pressure on it from the tissues of the area. And if you look on the ultrasound machine, I'm, I'm up higher on her leg. I'm looking at it with ultrasound. This is the fascia, this white line, and that's the actual nerve. As I go up her leg, sits a little bit rounder. See how round it is? That dark area is the nerve. Now I'm going down towards her ankle. And watch what happens as we go down and go down and go down. See how flat it gets? And so that's the pressure, we believe, of the fascia pushing down on the nerve. And that proves physically that there's some pressure on that nerve. And if you look where I ended up, right here is a mark. And that's the mark that I put on the leg because when we do surgery, we can plan our incision accordingly because we know that's about where the nerve tunnel is. And if I take this pen, I'm gonna show you what's happening. Here's the, the nerve and the paper, the drape here, let's pretend that's the fascia. Beneath the fascia is where the muscles are and the nerve, but the nerve is traveling along the fascia right here and right where it's compressed and compressed the most is where the opening is. So we just open up the sheath going up that way. So that's basically what we do. Hope you enjoyed this video, give you more information about how we can help you with the restless legs.